Let's get cold tonight, guys. Like 38 degrees. That's cold for us. Ship of Salvage Dreams is already starting to get greenery on the side of the hill. We're not going to get into the freeze. We've even got wildflowers out and flowers on top of the blackberries. You see over here, there's little berries over there. There's flowers, those new berries too. We have grapes too coming. The grapes have already started. The vines are going to be coming out soon too. Going back over here and show you a real quick view of all the houses if you want to come out and stay. That's a covered bridge over untroubled waters. And this is Walton Pond. Okay, so when you get to come out, that's the USS Minnow. Anybody remember that on Gilligan's Island? Guess where it ended up? Up there, the ship of Salvage Dreams, the top of Miracle Mountain. When you come and visit the fox, the birds, not just snowbirds, but real birds, as they settle in at night, we have all the frogs, we have all the Excuse the air because they eat them all. And so the idea is you see the greenery starting, come on down and see it all. We're gonna take a quick run and suddenly reappear inside of the house and show it because it's getting a little breezy. But come and see us soon. Now, next spot, watch Abracadabra. This is Trinity here. One of the neat things about visiting Salvage, Texas is the interaction with all the animals. Here we have got Maggie and Dottie and our little chicken flipper. One of the animals you can interact with. Pet the goats, walk the goats, feed the goats. One of the fun things to do here. Okay, would you think we have the garden on the pond? Yes. yes. Now, welcome to my little hideaway. This is a great bed for somebody. It's a nice little cozy A big bed. And a kitchen. And an air conditioner if it's summertime. And go outside, that's Walton Pond, man, tie back. And if you go up sideways here, off the porch, you get to see, literally, it takes off at night, flies on the wood and lands early morning. It's down here, the ship of salvage dreams on Miracle Mountain. And you'll be sleeping on Walton Pond, one of the many spaces we have. Over here's our little kitchenette. And when you go back over there, you have a little place to sit. And we even have a waiver and this is so you can sign and say gee if I fall in and hurt myself and drown in the ponds and on the cliffs then we won't be responsible so when you come and visit there's all sorts of things to do in town and you can have a little romantic evening is this one all right that's this one bye here we, here we are guys oh, I brought flowers for you isn't that sweet normally this little space here, a nice size bed, and another bed up there. And you got a kitchenette, which means coffee in the morning. We can put out a little heater. It's cold. It's going to be cold tonight. And we have little snacks for in the morning, and all sorts of little goodies. And then your bathroom. So you can learn how to do this using tiles, floor, old sinks. It's so simple, we want you to know how. And if you don't want to have a big toilet, that allows you to put an RV commode in here and uses one pipe per flush. And if you were smart, you could actually bring a five gallon bottle out and get quite a few flushes off of just a five gallon bottle of water. Imagine that. Off grid. So, on to the next one. Ah, this actually has a couch, a little place to rock, you can rock and roll. All right. Now we're on the way. Alright guys, this is the last one we're doing today. It's a quickie. Luckily it's little. Oh, it's warm too. Ah, this is our little kitchenette. And this one, oh, I was just working on this. This is our little shower over here, believe it or not. Oh, do you believe in a tiny house this size, 67 square feet, there's extra space really nice in the summertime actually, you take a little shower. And then you have a little kitchenette. Make coffee in the morning, a little place to wipe out, wash out. And if you want to have snacks and stuff, you can bring them. And then upstairs, there's actually a bedroom here. And if you want to eat dinner, you can actually sit down at the little dinner table and have a snack. Chinese to go, anybody? Except we don't have a Chinese place nearby. 
then upstairs. Believe it or not, I could stand up here with a hand on it. If I really wanted to, then I got tired. I can actually lay down. Oh, very carefully. Fall asleep. This has a nice view of right there. A little mountain. And this is wide open. That way, if you want air at night, you can actually. Okay. And we go downstairs. Oh yeah, this has air conditioner too. And the heater. My foot. And the heater. So you can be warm, you can be cold, you can be happy. 